Good morning, welcome to Mama Says Kitchen. I'm going to share something very quickly with you today. I wanted to do a recipe because I know you look forward to it. This is not going to take long so I can get right back to shipping the cookbooks. But this is something that reminds me of my sweet mama so much. She always made this around Christmas time, but it's good anytime. Matter of fact, we're going to have it tonight. But it is in the cookbook. It's called a five cup salad. Now, I know many of you probably already have this recipe, but this is for the ones who don't. It can be made with your favorite fruits. Um, you can add things to it if you want, but I'm going to share how I make it. The first thing that it calls for um, is a cup of pineapple tidbits. Now y'all, you can use the pineapple chunks, but the tidbits are a little bit smaller. And I have drained these and I'm just gonna put those in my mixing bowl. Okay, then it calls for a 15 ounce can of mandarin oranges and I have drained those. I'm gonna add these in here. <clears throat> All right, a cup of coconut. I'm not going to measure it. I'm just going to put what I think is about a cup. And if I put a little bit more, that's okay because I like coconut. And then it calls for a cup and a half of the tiny marshmallows. All right, I'm not going to measure these. And if I need to add more, I can. But the reason I think this is called five cup salad is it has five ingredients. And most of them are about a cup. Then, <clears throat> excuse me, the last thing is a cup of sour cream. I think I'm gonna get questions, can you use yogurt? And you can if you want to. But mother's recipe, called for sour cream and that's what I'm using. So now I'm just going to mix all of this. Let me get the very last of this sour cream out. It wasn't much, but don't want to waste it. I just put it in my big pan so I can mix it good. It's very pretty too, but it's good. And you know, when I made the grape salad the other day, Harold and I ate on it for a couple of days and it's very good at night for just a little snack. And this is also, if you would like to add some cherries to this and give it a, you know, a real pretty red little pop of color in there. Okay. Do you see how pretty that is? I'm going to put this in a bowl that I will serve it in. You see, it really didn't take long at all to do this. Y'all, baby Blake was two months old yesterday. He almost, almost, um, is up to three pounds. I'm gonna get me a little of it out just to show you, but I'm not gonna taste it. I'll tell you why. I'm doing that intermittent fasting where I don't eat anything for so many hours and my window's not open yet, but I'm gonna show you what it looks like on a plate. And that is very, very good. I'm gonna put it back in there. And at two o'clock when I can eat, 
it's gonna be very good. But y'all, um, I do want to tell you, uh, I'll, I'll share a lot more with you later, but Blake, uh, they're saying he'll be at the hospital for at least two more months. He, um, I think I've told you, I may not, that his diagnosis is mosaic trisomy 22. And I'm telling you, it's amazing what a fighter that little boy is. And he is a blessing to us. Thank you so much for continuing to pray for him. And um, baby Henry has gone home with hospice. So I will tell you to continue to pray because God can do anything. We, do, we may hear a bad report, but nothing is impossible with God. And keep continuing to pray for baby Henry and his mother and daddy. I forget their name, but they need your prayers. Okay, I'm going to leave right now, and I'm going back in the office, and I'm going to start packaging cookbooks, and I hope to have them all out by the middle of next week, those that I had promised to get out. But anyway, I can't leave unless I tell you to be salt and light. My necklace has gotten so much um, recognition when I wear it. People look and say, oh, what does that say? And I get the opportunity to tell them that Jesus wants us to be salt and light in this dark world. I hope you have a great day, and I'll be back soon.